Hi boys and girls, how's it going? <laughs> I am very excited to uh, be doing this video. In this box is my new Hagstrom H82 bass guitar, or as I call it, H8 the second. It's an eight string bass guitar that has just been, that was sent to me by uh, Hagstrom via their um, official dealers for the UK, Rossetti Music. And uh, now I'm gonna open the box with the help of my trusted friend. I've just uh, taken this beauty out of its uh, bigger box and now I'm gonna reveal it right in front of you and Very excited. Uh, a lot of people might think this is a bit of a novelty, and it probably is. Uh, these bass guitars were made in the 60s by Hans, back by Hackstrom, and uh, the original version of these bass guitars look very similar to this. Obviously, this is much better built with much better machine heads and bridge. And uh, it's uh, all mahogany, neck and body, and I can feel it. I can feel the weight of it. It's nice and sturdy. It's a slightly shorter scale bass guitar, so uh, it's not um, 34 inch, which is full normal bass guitar scale. This is a uh, this is almost 31 inch, slightly more than 30 inch. So uh, yeah, it's an interesting scale length and. The way it works is every every string is tuned like a normal every every one of the main strings is tuned like a normal bass guitar. So starting from the thickest E A D uh, G that took me a while, didn't it? Oops. Vial and each of those strings is doubled up with another string but octave up. So you have E and then you have another string next to it, which is tuned E one octave up from the original string and um, same for all the other strings. So uh, essentially it will sound like um, like a 12 string, well it's the same sort of idea like a 12 string guitar. Now I'm going to tune this up quickly and I'm going to speed this up because it's the boring part. Now that it's uh, tuned up okay, <sighs> I can tell you that it works as well. So much fun to be had with this. Now the strings are a bit high off the neck so I'm going to need to set it up properly. And uh, there are quite a few buttons here and I don't know what they do so I'll be playing with those and I will be letting you know what they do in the next few videos. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to ask any questions you need to ask, and this is my new baby. Alright.